It's Gaza Bounce time and your daily dose of positive attitude. And this morning we'll talk to you about Conkers. Because how many of you used to play Conkers when you was a kid? How awesome was that game? You used to go out, used to go out and hunt for that perfect Conker, get the perfect size so you could rule the playground. You know, I mean, we used to do we used to do such crazy things. We used to, I mean, I used to put my soak mine in vinegar. I used to cook it in the oven. I'd even save some conkers that I thought were awesome. I'd leave them in a cupboard for the until the next year. So the the following year, when I took them out, they were just so tough that they were going to smash through anything that got thrown at it in the playground. You know, and that's the reason for this today is because life is like a conker because if you can create the perfect conker, then you know, it doesn't matter how many times it gets hit, you can keep hitting it and hitting it and that conquer is just going to keep swinging back and just keep coming back for more. And, you know, the reason for this analogy is that you need to understand that what your inner strength is. Because it doesn't matter how many times people hit you, how many people, uh, life keeps throwing all these bad obstacles in your way. If you if you know what your dream is, if you know what your goal is and what your purpose is in life, you'll just keep coming back. You'll keep coming back for more because you know what that inner strength is. See, life is like a conquer. So start fighting back. Start creating that inner belief, that knowledge, that strength, that determination that you need to keep coming back no matter what anyone throws or throw, anyone throws at you. You know, that inner strength is so important so don't start cracking under the pressure of life because you know if you know what your purpose is you can keep moving forward okay so don't crack under pressure so keep strengthening your own conquer so you can start ruling the playground yourself become that 150 or that 200 that you always wanted to do and don't be a goose <laughs>